Alrighty, I'm going to show you how to use uh, a um, proximity uh, sensor, which looks like this. And there's many, many different types. Uh, this one happens to stay always closed. Uh, the other kind is always open, and there's many others, but uh, this happened to be attractive, uh, I mean, to detect uh, metal or aluminum. Uh, it is not going to detect plastic or your hand or something. Okay, how do you connect them? So there's three wires coming out of the proximity sensor. Black goes to the pin number two, not to the ground, by the way. Brown one is a positive, and then the blue one is a negative. So if you connect this to your uh, breadboard uh, or to an Arduino, uh, one more time, blue is, the big, is going to be your ground. Brown one is going to be your positive or 5 volts. And this uh, happened, this sensor, by the way, works in 5 volts just fine. And the black one is actually data pin, and it goes to the Arduino pin number 2, which is right over here. Now, you're going to go, why, why do I have all these other wires in here? Okay, so uh, I have a, a white LED. I have a red LED, which is the white wire. And then I have a buzzer, which is the brown wire over here. Okay. And they're protected uh, with 200K roughly resistors uh, on each side, okay? Now, if I take the can and put it next to the sensor, then as you can hear, there's a low buzz and the white light comes on. In this case, and if I remove the can, uh, then the white light uh, uh, turns off and the red light is on. And by the way, on the back of the sensor as well, you're going to see a red light, okay? Now... What I did is pretty simple. Let me just show you my mess a little bit. There we go. And I don't know if you're going to be able to see this very well because I'm holding this by hand. Uh, but basically, there is the uh, sketch. I wrote a little command for the serial print commands, a little window. And if you size it to the minimum, in my case, it's 15 lines. Set it up to high baud rate. In this case, 230,400 bots. Then, as you can see, it says, uh, you know, that. Um, metal or aluminum detected yes, yes or no it's not and the value sensor value is zero now watch what happens as soon as I take the can and I put it next to the uh, sensor you're gonna hear the buzzer going as well as you can see that uh, this is printed a little lower uh, sensor has detected metal aluminum yes and the value is one remove it and it's going to jump back to the top and it's going to start saying no again. Now, uh, I don't know if you guys know, but uh, there is no uh, clear command uh, for the um, uh, for the COM port uh, display here. And so, uh, really, the only way I could emulate this was the way I just did it, okay? Uh, you guys have a great day.